One program that has had great success is the Rural Entrepreneurship Through Action Learning, or REAL program. The REAL program is a hands-on way to flesh out your business idea and see if it has potential. An added benefit is that students learn from each other and develop an important support and networking system. The mission of NC Real has evolved uh, as entrepreneurship has evolved. Early on, um, the mission of the program was very focused on uh, developing entrepreneurial skills. Uh, but as we began to transition in, in a new economy around North Carolina, particularly with the downsizing uh, of uh, furniture and textile and outsourcing, uh, the decline of the tobacco industry, folks began to look for new alternatives. And NC Real began to evolve their course offerings and their products, their curriculum, uh, to better mirror the marketplace. Uh, so they have evolved over time, but they've stayed on mission, and that mission is really about developing entrepreneurial talent and skills uh, and helping people uh, take and uh, have hope to stay in their community and choice uh, that they can either go to work for somebody and be um, very effective as an employee or pursue their own interest as a small business owner. Well, I think REAL has been a true success, but I think if you go through and talk to people who've benefited and been direct participants in the program, you'll find the excitement that you always want to see in young entrepreneurs. I, I you know, made a life decision to to stop and, and change, switch gears. I decided to start my own business because I had made enough money for everybody else on Main Street and I decided I'd like to make some for myself. I decided it was time to, to do it on my own. I decided to start my own business sort of out of necessity. I moved down here with my wife and there's not a lot of graphic design opportunities in Rutherford County. I had a goal. I wanted to be one of the first female contractors and on the same note, I wanted to help my husband in his expertise of business. A couple of things you have to have. You have to have passion for what you're doing. You got to do a business plan or find out what's going to cost. The education, do the homework, uh, do the research. I took a course at Robson Community College on entrepreneurship and get a basic understanding and it was called REAL and then um, the Royal Center contacted me, they wanted my business plan. Of course I had to write the business plan in my class. So when I submitted the business plan, it was sufficient enough, it, I didn't have to add anything to it. The center gave me a micro enterprise loan and they are the only ones I contacted. If it hadn't been for them, the dream couldn't have got started as smoothly as it did. We want rural North Carolina to succeed and we know that there are many entrepreneurs in rural North Carolina. We don't want them to start businesses unless they have the planning skills that will help them be successful and sustainable. And so today as we move forward into our next decade, we are working in conjunction with the Rural Centers Business Resource Alliance to build a system for entrepreneurs. And we feel like in this next decade, we're very much a part of the solution to help and bring economic uh, development into rural North Carolina. Thank you.